what's good YouTube? It's your boy, Mr. Wise Game, straight from the state of Alaska. And today we have a brand new reaction on the this track king on YouTube, aka my boy Rice Gum. I wish that was my friend. I wish we were a friend. That would have been dope. Y'all probably wonder real quick why the hell this nigga got two jackets. My nigga, it's Alaska. It's getting colder by the goddamn minute. But yo, this is not about what I'm wearing. It's about the video. And my boy dropped a diss track on Bazinga. One of them niggas who did like a, if you, you probably guys know him about him doing multiple videos with like, you know, he did one with Ice Cube and, uh, and Kevin Hart when uh, Central Intelligence came out. You know, he did a few challenges with them niggas and a lot of challenges with Sidemen if you guys are watching. A lot of side men video, but 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 yo, I'm, I, I wonder what the hell Rice gonna lay down for this nigga. You feel me? You know what? Let's get right into this video, like for real. Let's let's see what's good with it. You need let 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 run it up. Out of all the side men, you got the least amount of subs. Oh. Hey, yo, fat ass looking like the little chubby boy from Is Up. This, Maybe I want to do this. Oh, preview. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, hey guys, I, I was it's like, me hold again. Up. So the other day I was just minding my own business, you know, just basically trying to stay out of drama, right? And out of nowhere, this guy tweets out saying, Rice Gum is a dick. What the heck, dude? Like, you know, why is he being so mean? You know, bro. I've never I'm offended him, you know, soon. personally. So at One this day. point, I'm just really confused. Uh, oh, shit. Like, why is this random guy calling me a dickhead, right? So then he tweets again saying, Why am I not in the YouTube Rewind? I started a shitty diss track trend. Notice the people that grinded, please, YouTube. Putting that in quotation marks. And so it kind of makes sense now. So I think he's calling me a dickhead because I made some comments on how. How I felt like I should have been in the YouTube Rewind, which I guess he disagrees with, and on top of that, I because I started a I shitty dish track trend, in one which year, I hope he understands nuts. that, you know, I can't just pick, you know, what becomes a trend, you know, trends kind of just happen randomly. But whatever, man, haters are gonna hate, life moves on, right? And I was just gonna ignore the situation because I, hey, like I didn't know who he was, you guys probably have no haters. idea who he is either. So, you know, I was just gonna remember. ignore the whole situation, right? But the then, a YouTube channel that basically covers, you know, all the YouTube drama, and they get quite a bit of views, well, well, they basically covered the story. One YouTuber known as Bazinga tweeted this out. He said, Ricegum is a dickhead. So it looks like Bazinga is talking some shit about Ricegum here as well. Now, a bunch of other YouTubers got pretty- And so now, more people were informed that this guy calls me a dickhead. And you know me, I have a reputation. You know, I can't just let this slide now. <laughs> people are gonna be like, slide oh, I don't this dude called Ricegum a dickhead and Ricegum didn't do anything. <laughs> Ricegum's a bitch. Ah, so I'm basically <laughs> forced to make a video on this guy and I don't even know who this guy is. So I decided to search around his Twitter oh, a little bit and just look what I found. This girl tweets, I need a puppy in my life, so if anyone has one that needs taken care of, I will do that for you. And so this guy replies, got a puppy in my pants. That's what you call a and so she thirsty ass back with nigga. Poor puppy. AKA and then he says, a fuck boy. Will you take care of it? I mean, for real. And then she says, I'm that's more of a big dog I mean, you will respond to a girl that's like, really good at thing. picking Come up now. girls. He actually has videos of him going out and actually picking up girls. Take notes, this guy is talented. I've lost my teddy bear. Will you sleep with me? No. Nigga. Oh my god, this guy is amazing. He's just so smooth. You know what? Let's actually watch what, more what of his videos. Let's that watch his most not be that popular thirsty. video. What's up guys and welcome to the quick- Oh shit, there's like 10 other big YouTubers in this video. Let's actually watch his second most popular video. What is up everybody and welcome- Damn, another collab video? Wait, let's watch his third most hmm? popular video. What is up ladies and gentlemen and welcome to today. Oh, and Kevin, Kevin Hart and Ice Cube. Wait, let's watch his fourth most popular video. What is up ladies and gentlemen welcome today. Wow, another collab video wait let's watch his next most popular video oh, here i'm joined with vic we've got kevin hart and we got dwayne john kevin hart and the rock this time wait let's watch his next most popular video what is up ladies and gentlemen oh, yeah, right on the why are all go. his most popular videos featuring somebody else Oh wait, because when he posts a video with himself and the camera, he doesn't get any views. What do you he mean? That's a lot of views. Shout out to my videos getting like, that many views, nigga. He only gets views when someone cool is yeah. in his video. Like, he has no viral video by himself. This dude is literally irrelevant. I'm already giving this guy too much attention. Afrogram, grab the mic. Oh, they're running up. Mm-mm. <coughs> <coughs> Out of all the side men, you got the least amount of subs And your fat ass looking like the little chubby boy from Up Man, you upload every day, I get more views uploading weekly Someone tell me why this man look like the fat Ronald Weasley Seen him try to talk to girls, I was cringing to death 
can't blame him, he's a loser, he was trying his best No sus, but he probably got some real nice breasts I can't tell if it's Bazinga or the real life Shrek <laughs> Yeah, you about to take this out, but wait, is what you need to lose KSI, that's your daddy, without him you get no views I could call up KSI and tell him, kick you from the crew All your biggest vids are collabs, yeah, it wasn't cause of you I <gasps> start trends, you play FIFA, boy, stay in your lane stay in your I lane. saw you playing soccer, you should stick to them games <laughs> You got two mil subs, in a year I got five Boy, you so irrelevant, this was a waste of my time like seriously dog, this was such a waste Damn. of time. No one knows who the I think fuck you, just you are. I'm him. helping you out. That is I, I just never savage see you this right there. Again, Damn. Boy. Stop he said, boy, you only got two minutes. Like I got five on here, boy. What you doing? Damn, I'm struggling to get 1,000 myself. I just really don't like when people call me dickhead. But yeah, guys, this video is shorter than usual because I don't want to give this guy too much attention. But I'm going to make it up to you. So basically, there's this YouTuber named Jack Septic guy. I'm pretty sure you guys know who he is. He has like 13 million subscribers. Humongous channel, probably like top five oh, biggest gaming channels channel. on YouTube. But basically, a month ago, he tweeted, "Gonna make a new channel where I only do roast and diss tracks, so I can whore out everyone's name in the title." Hey, you have to be a genius <laughs> to figure this out. This tweet is probably about me. I mean, who else on YouTube does roast and diss track? But he's basically saying, "I only get views because I use other people's names in my tiles." Basically, I whore them out, which is kind of whack because you know, I feel like I bring more to the table than just putting people's name in the title. You know what I mean? I feel like. I'm kind of funny where I get views by myself. Nah, nigga, you funny as hell. Come on. You know you're funny. Nigga, you know you're funny. taking away credit from my success, you know? Whatever. So I'm annoyed and I hit the studio. I drop a diss track. I record a video. You know, I'm about to go in on this guy. Oh. So I tweet out saying, new Jacksepticeye diss track dropping tomorrow. And then Jacksepticeye follows me on Twitter and DMs me. Hey, man, just wanted to say I wasn't trying to <laughs> dig at you with the tweet from the I want this nigga to diss track on me. Hell no. I want this nigga to end me. People just blew it out of proportion. It sound like I was attacking you, no ill will intended. God damn. Once again, obviously that tweet, if you read it over, you can say it's about other channels, you can say it's about, you know, someone else. No one else on YouTube is making roast and diss tracks. Like, that tweet was targeted to me, right? I felt like he heard I was making a diss track and he was like, oh shit, fuck. I'm gonna say sorry and hopefully he doesn't diss me. <laughs> I don't want and that nigga to roast worked. me. No, 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 no. I was like, you know what? <laughs> oh, yeah. that tweet was oh no, me, no, no. I'm gonna be the bigger person and be like, you know what? Jack's up the guy. I accept your apology. We're cool now. Whatever, right? So I end up not even dropping the diss track, you know, because he said sorry. I'm like, you know, whatever. He followed me. We're friends now, right? Okay. And then two weeks later, this dude unfollows me. He's like, yeah, Rice Gum didn't drop a diss. Fuck this guy. Right, should have dropped it. Like, should have dropped it yeah, right after cool. he so unfollowed you. Unfollowed drop me. that so I guess shit, we're not cool anymore. So he literally just DM'd me that just so I couldn't roast him, right? So the diss track is ready. I can upload it tomorrow, but Brad, should do I it. though? I don't want to do make it. a decision myself. Do so it! You guys do it. Comment below, should I drop yes. the next up the guy diss track? Yes! I mean, he did say sorry, but like, come on, bro. That tweet was about me. And then he unfollows me after. I also want this video to get a lot of thumbs up. So thumbs up the video, subscribe if you are new. More videos coming soon. Thank you for all the support. Five million subscribers. You guys are so beautiful. And you guys are- Yeah, man, that's it for the video, man. If you guys want to see the full video without my black ass talking over it, over it. Check out the link in the description. It will direct you directly into the damn video. If you guys enjoyed the video, definitely leave a like. If you're new to the channel, definitely feel free to subscribe. Was the roast, was, was, was it Distract Fire? He got some pretty good line. I mean, you can't lie about that shit. I mean, shit, you got two million sub. I got five in a year. Like, goddamn, that line right there was just nigga. Damn, end it. Just go home. Just, just go home. But yo, guys, man, it was pretty lit. And um yeah, I hope I hope you guys enjoy it. That little reaction. I don't do that shit that often, but you know, when Ryan's gonna drop something, you gotta dick hopping into that video and then do a quick reaction, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but on this note, be careful, take care yourself, and I'ma see you guys into the next video. Doses!